Welcome back team, you're Gaming with the Colonel and this is Strategic Command WW2 World at War, my continuing multiplayer game against Pavia, where he is the Axis and I am the Allies. When the last we left off, I believe he had four hexes com almost completely surrounding Paris. Yeah, that's right. Now we'll see what happens here. Obviously, uh, we're going to get smoked like a cheap cigar here. That's all right. Maybe we can do some damage to him. A little bit. And then he'll die miserably. So, and we'll see what we got going on. Trenchment is likely... I'm surprised he did that with those units. They would have been good to uh, attack with. Okay. Here comes the armor, and that'll be that. Hey, well, he's breaking his teeth on it, but that's okay. All right, there we go. It's out. It's gone. Now he's going to get as much experience as he possibly can. This is not a surprise. We knew this was going to happen. Hurt him at least. Damn it. I don't know if I'd be doing this right now. I'd probably be moving him to the other front. Okay, there goes that unit. So I've got one, two, three, four, five units left. So times three, that's a 15% chance. Okay, I've got two submarines that are open. Okay, ooh, that hurt him. That hurt him real good. How did that happen? Okay, he's gonna have to get out of Dodge there. A garrison unit messed me up. Man, I'm in the mountains, so this shouldn't hurt too bad. And I don't think he removes entrenchment from the... There we go, that hurts. I'll have to swap that guy out. Cheng Gao is not doing well. He's in the marsh there, so I'm going to hurt that guy. All right, so he surrendered. All right. Paris has fallen, folks. France is out of the war. That would happen. Let's see here. Everything's captured. France surrenders. Naval base at uh, Saint Nazarene. The sheep declares loyalty. They annex. They lose 24 there. UK prepares for invasion. And they get the extra five. Okay, so three or more units within 10 hexes of Birmingham. That's usually never a problem. Uh, do we recognize them? Absolutely. It looks like my plane went away as well. Uh, convoys, five destroyers, four. Yes, we're going to do that. Bases for destroyers? Yes, please. Would you like to send these tanks to reinforce the 7th Armored, or would you like to deploy them to the UK? We're going to deploy them to Africa. Um, 
Okay. Do we want to spend it to create a unit for these men? Would you like to form the Polish unit? Absolutely. Let's do that. What if I don't? Does he, do the Russians get the opportunity? Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do it, though. Okay. Polish Corps forms near London. All right. Aircraft orders. If we give them to Canada, UK will receive it. Uh, if we keep them, we receive it. Let's send them to Canada. We keep them, we get a bomber. They get a tactical and a maritime. Cost us 25. Yeah, let's do that. Now we're probably going to uh, relocate that bad boy. Can operate him for 30. Okay. And uh, we're probably going to send him down here to this place. Okay, so now we've got a couple of ways we can go about hurting him here. One is this. I dove. Okay, that's good. He lost two. Okay, so that didn't work out as well as I had hoped. Okay, this is the headquarters. It's going to land here and probably end up moving forward. We have a problem here. You, you need to be upgraded. You need reinforcements. Okay, let's hold on. Let's check research first before we work this. We're at 1750. Um, I don't think I need command and control at the moment. I think what I need is, I got armored warfare. Rayrard, remember? Yeah. Okay, so I think what I'm going to go with here is a production technology shit. Okay, and I'm going to Reinforce this guy. Going to move him back. Oh, hold on. Moving him back doesn't really help. Let's move. Um, I do want to bring this guy in. How much money do I have? 168. Let's check down here first. This guy got smoked like a cheap cigar. He's got to move back. Here. got an army there so he's doing the cluster defense here so maybe I sent that guy to the wrong spot can he make it up there maybe let's get back on there He's doing the cluster defense. I don't know that I have. Well, I got a one there. 
but only if I take this. Four, three, two, one. That's as far as it goes. If I move him, he'll lose. So we're getting that stick. Over here, it's four, three, two, one. That's as far as you go. So what do I do with him? I think I move him. How much does it cost to take care of him? Five points for 78. That would not be good. This guy can only get two points, so he's moving up to here. You're going to move to here. You're going to come around and drop in here. So if I move him to here, supply this turn is six, next turn it should be seven. No. If he doesn't give supply to him, Interesting. I think I need to move him there, and that's okay. That can happen next time. These guys are going to need to get out of dodge. Uh, let's see. Is there anybody here? Get him to here. And get him to here. That's not far enough. Let's protect him. This guy can't make it there. I'm not going to risk him coming out. Uh, especially since the air... Now, I don't want to, if I do that, he'll see me. So I don't want to risk that. I'm going to leave him alone. Okay, I got 168 left. And I can do another 125 research. So I could do another industrial. Um, and I probably should. Let's do that. Research is important, especially for the Brits. Okay, hold on. I can't do that, unfortunately. Um, that costs 150 But I could do this. Okay, so now I'm down to no money. Well, let's go ahead and uh, upgrade, or at least reinforce the things I need to reinforce. Okay, so I still don't know where his units are. But I'm guessing they're going to try to make a run into these ports. So let's cover that one. Let's cover this one. He can see me there. Let's make it look go down and go up. Okay, you cover Bergen. You're going to take an upgrade. You're going to come and uh, do this. All right. 
I got a little bit of money left here. So you get one. Hmm. It's vitally important to cover down on my air. Casey tries a sea lion. This guy's going to get thumped. I don't think I have enough here. I should have brought the... Uh, do I want to go repair him? Or do I want him out here in case he comes out? I think I'm going to take him up here. Be, uh, but before we do that, we're going to change it to fighters. Let's give myself some, some air cover here. Let's enable cruise you up to this port. If he decides he wants to come out and mess with these guys, then I'll have another carrier here to help out in the Mediterranean. I need to go after the, uh, the Italian fleet now that it just got hurt a little bit. That'll work out just fine. The other thing I could do is I can move these guys forward. I don't think he's going to leave the Med at this point. He might. He might try to do that. His subs are both injured, and he's got two injured units, other units. So... There's that. Okay, so we've got this thing closed kind of down. Let's bring you here. You're a supply of 8. You're a supply of 12. Let's get your supply back. Again, we only have a little bit of money. We can upgrade this guy to nine. Or we could do something down here. Not much, however. This is the cluster defense. Okay. So we need to get rid of him, and then we can come on down and work these. And that'll be fine. The other thing we can do is try to go after this. Hem him in a little more. Be nice to get some air down there. So, you know, a tactical bomber. It's going to have to get upgraded. And I'm going to do... I don't know, something fun. Where's my strap bomber? That's my strap bomber. What does he cost to operate? I don't know. I'd like to get him down there. I'd love to be able to strap bomb Tobruk into oblivion. Okay, what else do I have going on that I need to worry about? These guys. We killed that... Uh, that one guy. All right, yeah. Air. Reinforce. Max. Leaving me with only four money. Um, Guys in Manchester. He's got to stay there. I'm 
Let's put you in Birmingham. And the rest of you are fine, I think. The only thing I might want to do is swap these guys out. Go ahead and bomb this guy. Or that guy. He's got air, though. It's going to... I don't think he's moved his air yet. He just took it, so I don't think that's a smart move on my part. Um, let's instead move you here. Actually, this is okay. All right, let's go to the U.S. Research. You are not maxed. You got two to industrial. We really want to get the other infantry weapons. And that leaves us with 93, so nothing else. Next time, the second anti-air defense chit. All right. Soviets. 48% mobilization. He is working. He's coming back here. Do I care about Novograd? See what uh, research. I'm working my way towards the second one. August this winter is going to be some upgrades, I think. For now, let's get the Industry Two. Wait. Yeah, Industry Two is important. Okay, leaving me with 195. production to. I really want a headquarters, but this is, getting double chits on these is really, really nice. Okay, so leaving me with not a lot of money. You can back up a little bit. You're still covering those guys, so that's fine. Hmm. What do I do here? You're coming down here. I, I believe I have... So let's put this fighter... Here in Bristol. I'll worry about China in a second. So what I don't have... You, oh, they got artillery. Very nice. That will definitely be helpful. That will definitely be helpful, and I think I'm going to send it down here. Even though it won't be under uh, the auspices of a commander, it will reduce entrenchment. So he'll head down there, and that'll work out fine. India also has some money to either purchase... Can't get another headquarters, that's off limits. And can't buy anything else, so we'll hold. Okay, yep, okay, China. So before we leave the Soviet Union, let me make sure that I don't forget once again to move these guys. Right. 
upgrade those with air defense, but I'm not really all that keen on it. Wait a second. Do no, I not even have a, a first infantry weapon? I do not. That's going to be ugly. It's going to be ugly, guys. Okay, China. Or Japan, China. Okay, so what are we going to do here? This guy's definitely going to have to swap out. Would have been happier to have an army here, but let's go ahead and... Okay, hold on here. Let's check this first. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Yeah, that's all good. Um, you're going to get one. You're going to get one. So your morale is 39. Yours is 55. Yours is 71. You have one entrenchment. Everybody has one entrenchment. I'll just reinforce them in place. All right, where's my areas? He's working. He will find it hard to bust through there for sure. Okay, you're going to have to catch up. You're going to get swapped out. Let's see, what do you got? Yeah, 29. That's suboptimal. 62, now 50. Not great. Let me reinforce you to a max of 2. Bummer. You're not close enough. Next turn. Next turn, you're going to be good. Okay. Next turn, you're going to be good. What about him? He's going to be better. Okay. So over here, we definitely need to uh, fix you. That will not allow me to do any research then at that point, or will it? No, it will. Okay, so hold on. So we'll go and go ahead and do this. And now we have a choice. No, yeah, now we have a choice. We can either do some research, and industry research, right? Or we can purchase that other anti-air that we desperately need up here. We do have a core. That's stable. That's all stable. Put it here. Okay, so do we buy the anti-air? Or do we get the additional chip? It's August. Purchasing the anti-air now. It'll come in November where it's going to be rainy and stuff anyway. So I think we're going to do the research. Taking other things into consideration at the moment. All right, so that works. As long as we can hold this, we're doing good. Okay, so we spent all our money. Uh, we forgot to move him. We need to move him up north. Okay, so that's next time. And he needs to be operated, so that's next time, because I ran out of money. All right, that's unfortunate. What do we have left? Four, not enough to do anything with this. All right, we're going to hit the go button, see what happens. Pavia, it is your turn. Morale is shaking. Um, do we need to attack it? Yeah, we kind of do.
person activity in Manchuria. So he still doesn't have this covered. Oh no, rough seas. De Gaulle says the war is not over and they vow to continue the fight. UK gets production technology one, outstanding. You get advanced fighters, that's great. Um, amphibious, that's great as well. So we're gonna have to continue down that path because as soon as they come in, we need amphibious stuff, right? So, uh, good, anti-tank weapons, outstanding. We might end up buying some of those. I think I'm gonna get some more anti-tank stuff. We got advanced fighters, so they're got they're good to go. And production one. Infantry warfare gets a break. That's outstanding. Production technology for China. India gets infantry weapons one. We'll be upgrading them next time. And they get infantry warfare. Outstanding. That worked out really well. That was a good turn for uh, for research okay so we don't get a lot next time we got a lot of stuff to do so we'll see what happens you've been gaming with colonel please like subscribe come back early and often for now i'm out